ever be willing to try to get her to sit down with possibly Cardi B and Lil' Kim to try to mend their differences? I would love to see that. I would love to see them all come together. I, I think that we all would love to see that, but people would have to be willing to to do that. And to be perfectly honest with you, I, she's going to kill me for even saying this, but I did reach out to Kim. Okay. Okay. okay? And it's just so, not man, it's your boy DP100, and you is now watching 100 TV. And today we got the Queen Nikki, man. Yes, Nikki Minaj, straight out of Southside, Jamaica, Queens. We got some news involving Nikki, Deborah, Anthony, and Little Kim. Now, if you don't know who Deb is, Deb is the mother of Waka Flocka, and also Deborah Anthony is responsible for helping Nikki in her career when she was first starting out. Deborah Anthony was the one that got Nikki her first deal. I don't know if it was Fendi, but they say that it was Deborah. I don't know. But right now, we have Nicki Minaj goes off on Deborah Anthony, man. Yes, because it seems like Deborah was trying to go behind her back to squash the beef with Little Kim, and the Trini gal Nicki was not having it. You know them Trini girls is different, man. If it's smoke, they gonna keep that spliff burning for a long time. If it's smoke, it's up. So it seems like Nicki did not like the fact that Deborah Anthony went behind her back to try to make a peace treaty. Mm -mm -mm. And Nicki Minaj wasn't having it. So Nicki went on her social media and this is what she had to say to Deborah. She said, Deb, isn't it funny how you left out the biggest part of the story? Gag City. Second leg tour in the U.S. begins September. Next stop, Italy. Previous stop, Morocco. Almost 200K beautiful people came out. I didn't ask you to do a thing. You told me after the fact and I screamed on you and told you if you reach out to people now that you're being seen around me, they would think that is coming from me so to never to do that again without discussing it with me first i said that i never wanted that and now she'll think that the message came from me which is not cool then she had went on to say so yeah you laughed it off and i said her and foxy should come out and i said no i only wanted foxy to come out on stage with me she's like family to me no disrespect god bless everyone and our children let us all do our thing and thank god for life stop using my name for clickbait in 2024 we get it. I'm that. How dare you? Interviews. Ciao. Woo wee. This world, man. This world. Love yourself deeply. So yeah, man. It seems like Little Kim and Nicki Minaj won't be kumbaya in no time soon. You know Nicki is the big sleaze out there. She ain't waving no white flags. She's waving them red ones. You feel me? So yeah, man. We ain't gonna be seeing no Kim and Nicki on stage no time soon. But it's 100 TV, man. Let me know how y'all feel about this in the comments. 100. You are now watching 100 TV, where we always keep it 100 over here. No clickbait, no cab news, just real authentic content. The 100 way.